What's going on, fellow YouTubers? It's Chris back with you guys with another cool video. All right, guys, this photo, this particular photo is from Opportunity, and I believe this is from Saul1613, and uh, you guys will get the link as always. Um, there's a couple anomalies that stand right out of this, right you know, out in this picture, I should say, um, without having to do a thing to it. And you're going to see that yourselves. Um, and, of course, you guys give me your thoughts, as always. I always tell you what I think it is. And then, of course, you guys have the last word. You know that. Um, because we're not always right, right? But uh, let's have a look, and I think you guys will like this. All right, let's jump right into here. And as you can see at the top, it is it does have the address to it, which you guys will get, as always, in the, in the, uh, <coughs> in the description box. But you know, guys also know that I've been leaving a pinned comment uh uh, just under my video, which also has the link. So it makes it a little bit easy. You don't have to go fishing around for it. But anyway, right off the bat, I saw these couple of objects. Uh, there's one here on the ground. And, of course, we got something up here, which to me looks like some kind of weird uh, biological, could have been biological life form at one time. And, of course, you guys can give me your take on it. Um, and we're just going to zoom in here just a little bit. I wonder where my Sunday paper went. There it is. But see, this is what I'm saying, guys. This is what's crazy. And, of course, I'm kidding. But uh, you can see on this photo that what the hell, that clearly does not look like a rock. And up here, to me, it almost looked like some kind of weird bird creature, if you will. And we're going to get into that right now. Let's jump into the uh, uh, Photoshop so this way I can show you guys a lot better. Now, I had this as a smaller photo, and this is the way it comes. And you can see right here is a 33%. It's right at the bottom of here. And what I do is I just kind of... You know, add some pixels there. We can blow the photo up so we can actually zoom into it. Okay, what's funny about this thing right off the bat is that when you go to up to the, your image in Photoshop, I've got CS6, if all of you guys have the same. Um, you can Right here, it's an RGB color. You're seeing nothing but black and white. However, it is an actual color photo. And you'll see this as I go along because as soon as I hit this here, I go into what I did was I went to the CMYK mode. Now, you can see where I started to actually burn this away. Look at the green colors and the funky colors that came out of this. Well, what's that tell you? There's manipulation going on in this photo in a big way. Now, of course, I believe a lot of it may be uh, the manipulation. It's, a, it's like a byproduct of the manipulation. And, and as soon as you start to try to burn over this, it actually shows a color. Um, am I spot on about that? Not sure, but that seems to be the case. All right. So I'm looking at this this item right here in the back, and I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you this guys this this is crazy. Watch this. Let's zoom right into it and have a close look. Now the first thing I thought of was that this thing was some kind of weird bird um, that you can see right there. It looks like it has like a tail feathers right here, right here, and then of course this looks like some kind of weird wing and maybe whatever the heck is over here. Maybe the head is tucked up underneath. I'm not sure what that is, but it clearly doesn't look like a surrounding rock, and I think you guys will agree with that. Um, also, take note, you notice how you get these other colored squares. See this? And a lot of them are conveniently placed. It looks like they're trying to hide, like, little details. Look at right here on the ground. Uh, yeah, pretty crazy stuff here. Um, let me jump into this more because what I did was I, I tried to bring out anything that was white still in this particular photo, or this, I shouldn't say photo, but this little anomaly. But check that out. What do you guys suppose that is? Is it not anything that could have been living? Is it possible um, that it's a piece of something mechanical? To me, it just struck me as weird that it completely is totally different from the uh, the background rock. It looked like something that just kind of fell onto this ledge, if you will. You know, picture of a bird, if it was a bird, of course, hypo hypothetically speaking, because there's no way to vet this. You guys know that. Um, and you get this weird, it, it could have just flew into the rock and it just basically landed on this ledge. Is that true? Again, no way to know. All right, so let's just jump into this because this is pretty crazy because what I did was, um, you can check this out. I, I went into the black and white on this because you can see this right here. Look at this. Look at all the, watch all the colors that pop back into this. Look at this. This is crazy. Now, as far as this thing here goes, which I think is pretty wild, check this out. What is that? It looks, it almost looks like a muffler from a car. I mean, you know, it's just got this elongated and it's, and it's a bright reflective, I'm going to use the term reflective, um, thing going on here. Now, you can see that right here. I don't know if this is going to work on this, but let's see what happens. Because I am using actual uh, recording software, so I don't know if it will work on this. But regardless, this here, of course I did this wrong, um, right here, that is just bizarre. You can see the way it looks oval, if you will. See that? And it has this 
I don't know. It's almost like something was rolled up or whatever, or it's a manipulation to hide what's really there. Of course, we know NASA would never lie, right? Um, but check this out. So I'm looking at this here, and I'm going, well, check this other object out. It almost looks the same way, has this oval shape to it, and you can see that running like this here. But you have this 90-degree angle piece sticking out of that. I don't know if you guys can see that, but check this out. It goes to the back, and of course, you can't see this side of it because of this mess that's here, but... It just gets better, guys. Check this out. Here's another thing I noticed. Almost looks like this weird log or something else, but notice how there's like this manipulation over this to kind of hide what this really is. See that? Now, if I do this, you can see that right there. You can just see this blurring this going like this and then dropping. And then, of course, you can see the rest of this item, whatever it may be, almost look like some kind of weird log type thing um, laying there. I don't know what that is. It, it just, but that's what it strikes me as. And like I said, you've got these other uh, anomalies here, but there's much more to this, guys. Much, much more. Um, check this out. I'm gonna go back a little bit. Now, I don't know if you guys noticed this. This is pretty crazy because this is the original right here. Let's look at the original photo. What I noticed was this thing right here. Now, it may be a rock, and that's fine with me too. But what's funny is I see this weird end to this thing. Now, let's have a look. Go color, and then what I do is I actually lighten this up so we can get rid of a lot of the shadows, and you can see that right here. Here's your shadowed area, of course. Um, and then, of course, you've got it all right here. Um, what I did was try to brighten this thing up so you can get rid of some of the shadows, but check this thing out. Whatever that may be, it has some real funky features to it. I don't know if you can see that, but it has some kind of weird things going on here. Now, is it, is it possibly it's nothing more than a rock? Sure. Um, but nevertheless, it's still kind of weird-looking, uh, and, and, you know, not so much the rock type thing, but just the way the thing looks. It just it just has these what looks like pieces protruding out of it. Um, this is also pretty weird because it looks like it has white piece here. And, of course, it's been manipulated all through here. And then you've got this what looks like a small pipe type hanging out of that thing. You see that? I'll get close in for anybody who's got the uh, smaller uh, phones and tablets and so on and so forth. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to jump right to the fully enhanced, and I want to show you guys this. Because this, to me, is just bizarre. You can see where I've gotten this out a little bit more. Maybe you guys will see something I don't. Nothing more than a rock. Cool with me, too. This, this thing right here, that just looks biological or something that was living or is alive. I don't know. Um, I don't know what to make of that. Maybe you guys can tell me what you think it is. Is it something that's... Uh, you know, is it something mechanical, although it don't look that way? Uh, it's just a real puzzling piece, this, this, there, you know. Um, and there's another couple other things I want to show you guys, too. Of course, we already went over this with this thing right here. Like, it looks, like I said, it looks like the Sunday newspaper. <laughs> and, of course, this weird-looking log thing. Here's another thing I find pretty interesting, too. I mean, as soon as I went over this, check out the edge of this thing all the way around. You can see where it has this, this edge and it just happens to be only this particular area. You notice that? And, of course, a couple other things that I happen to bring out right here. The computer's running slow here, but that's okay. Check this out. But it seems like all of a sudden these things are now popped up and it's got, like, other objects in there. You can see a little bit of white coming through that. And, again, guys, don't, don't be surprised. These guys, like NASA, JPL, whoever else has got their hands in here, that's what they do, man. That's what they do. They they literally put like a black or brown or anything they want to try to hide any object that's in these photos, and it wouldn't surprise me. Check this out. I don't know if you guys seen this, too. I mean, I don't know if this, this looks kind of like a rock, or is it some kind of weird petrified piece of wood? I'm not sure what to make of that. It could very well just be a stone. Check that out. I don't know. Uh, it may just be a manipulation that they put over an object that's laying there. Okay, let's have a look at the top of this, because this is pretty wild, too. It, I believe it's a manipulation, but it's hard to tell. Check out this object right here. And the reason why I said it looks like an, uh, some kind of manipulation, because notice how it just drops like this, goes down. Of course, you can't see it, but it looks like it's a half-round item. And then you've got what looks like these pieces running out horizontal and one going vertical. What that is... I have no idea, but notice that object sitting right there. A couple of these things, you know, I showed it to a friend of mine, and they were saying, I don't know if it was this one here or like right here, they're saying, well, that looks like some kind of weird kind of skull, as well as this one over here. kind of looks like it's kind of turned. 
I'm not so sure about all that. I don't usually see faces in mine. Um, I usually see more mechanical than anything. Um, check this out. Look at this. Blatant redaction of information. Just kind of like totally taken right out. Now, don't get me wrong. It is a low-res photo, okay? So I don't expect to see super clarity in any of these. However, a lot of these, like check this area out. This, this is just bizarre. I'm going to go back to the original. Look at this whole area, how it's completely blurred out, right? Zoom in. Check that out. But if you look and you can see like little bits and pieces of things, and it stops, goes across. There's actual item here, something. Now watch this. So what I do is I lighten it up, and then, of course, I used a, uh, the dodge tool uh, to try to bring it out. Anything that has a light signature, a whiter signature, it will try to bring it out. And it appears to have some kind of weird things laying on top of these rocks. See, like it's got this small circle type thing, and it's straight. Got these items right here. You can see this now. It's white going across. Now, is it more part of the ledge? Good possibility. However, why would you go out of your way to try to block this thing completely out? Clearly, there's something there they don't want you to see. I mean, to me, that's. I mean, you can just see that. Look at that blatant blurring. Completely taken out. And this was, too. And if again, if I go back to the original, you see exactly what I'm talking about. And, of course, because they put a docker up here in, in contrast, you don't know what the hell that is. So, again, we've got this other object that's doing this here, kind of like this one here. Now, is it rocks? Good possibility, I would say 70 80%, yes, it is. But then when you see these weird things sticking out of here, and you can see this this item still goes down. This one drops down. I don't know if you can see that. It looks like it almost has like this 90-degree piece right here. Of course, this could be nothing more than a, it could be actually compression, if you look at that right here, because I'm seeing this line. But what's funny about it, some areas you can see detail, then all of a sudden, look at this, completely blocked out like they're trying to hide something. Again, it could be part of the being low res as well. So, um, and I totally get that. That makes sense. Let's zoom into a lot of these little pieces here, these little bits and pieces, because this to me is just wild. Again, you've got this odd looking piece here. Has what looks like an oval piece at the end, kind of sort of like this one here. And of course, you got that there. And it does this, and of course, you can see this this whole piece here. But and you've got this 90 degree angle piece sticking right out of that. What could that be? I mean, what's the chance of a rock sticking out of a rock, if you will, right there? What is that? Nice 90 degree angle, boom. And of course, it looks like you. Looks like it might be still white going over here. I can't tell. See that? You can, yeah, you actually can. You can actually see the edge, and it kind of gets a little blurry right here, but then keeps going. This is all white right here. So, and it is, look at right there. You can actually see where it ends right there. I just noticed that now. Check that out. It is actually there, and it's sticking out. It's actually a, a flat piece sticking out of this other piece, again, with this oval shape. What's the chance of a rock doing that, guys? Um, okay, let's slide over to here. And check out these little multi pieces. Now these could be rocks, but notice how again, this right here is completely blurred out. Why? The rest of this seems to have pretty decent detail to it, yet this from here over is not. Same thing with this. There's some kind of white object sitting right here, and it looks like it's kind of got a curvature to it. All white, and all of a sudden it's completely brown. The rest of it's browned. It's been colored. It's been check that out. There's multiple pieces here. Uh, just things that really stand out. Now, some things are really vague, and we know that because clearly they're not going to let you see anything they don't want you to see. Um, I don't know if you guys notice this either, but check this out. It looks like almost like a face. If you tilt your head to the left, it looks like two eyes, a nose. Of course, I can't make out there's a mouth there or not, but it, that could be just pareidolia right there, but check that out. That's just kind of bizarre. Yeah. So... Anyway, guys, I'm just intrigued by this more than anything. Now, I did notice something here, and I don't know if you guys seen this as well. Uh, right here, it seems to have, like, this white area still going on. Now, is it part of something else, or is it part of, like I said, a, a, another part of this creature, or whatever this may be, uh, right here in this photo? What is that? What do you guys think that is? That was the biggest thing for me that stuck out in this photo. I just couldn't believe it. I'm like, what is that? So... Anyway, guys, tell me what you guys think this thing is, man. Uh, I just think that's just really cool and just really odd at the same time. Um, you guys will get, uh, you know, this link, as always, to this photo. I'm going to just zoom in again real quick for anybody who's got these uh, smaller phones and tablets. 
I know you guys have asked me that many times. Hey, Chris, do you think you can zoom in? And I'd be more than happy to. Uh, maybe you guys will see something I'm not seeing. Because I see things right off the bat. Of course, that's what you want to cover because you don't want to make the video extremely long. So that's why I try to keep it as, you know, 15, 20 minutes at best or at the longest, I should say. Um, and like I said, looks like that uh, Guardians from the Galaxy looks like Groot laying on his side. Um, again, I'm just kidding, but it kind of looks like that, doesn't it? Um, right here, this other weird looking, and you can see like a little bit of white coming through here. Um, could be just could be just rocks. And here's that other area. Like I said, it has this weird kind of straight edge going like this. And it just looks like a big cluster of garbage. And it only happens to be the only place that's concentrated anyway. I mean, it's still got some more here, but that's because I believe this is manipulation. Um, and just one more time up here, and then we'll be done with this. This object up here. Let me zoom into that. Right there. And again, you've got these weird, like, two pieces over here just kind of doing this. And then you've got it going, you know, vertically. So I don't know what that is there or what this may be. Is it possible that's nothing more than a manipulation? Good possibility. But you notice how it looks kind of blurry like this here. And then the rest of this is that, whatever they wanted to put over this. And then you've got these pieces that are kind of clear sticking out of that. Uh, again, you guys tell me what you think it is. Uh, a lot of these guys, I mean, this this. <sighs> There's manipulations all over these stones. I don't believe these are stones at all. Now, I'm not saying none of it is. I'm just saying that there's actual objects laying on these stones. Like, here's a perfect example. Look at this right here. I don't know what this is. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it, it's like you, you can see this white coming through the darker areas. There's something laying there, or at least right here. See that? I don't know. But clearly there's things in these photos that they're trying to hide. Again, look at this mess. I don't know what that is. But clearly, and you can see that. Look at that. Look at the blur. I mean, it's just insane. Look at this. Whoops. Just look at the look at how much blur that is. My God. Anyway, guys, I'm not going to make it too long. I just wanted to show you that. I got another cool Mars video coming up, and I think you guys will like this. This was actually uh, uh, brought to me by one of my subs. Uh, his first name, I believe, is Char. Uh, C-H-A-R. Um, I'm going to be doing that one next as well, so stay tuned for that, um, and I think you guys will like that one as well. Pretty cool stuff, and more anomalies just standing out, um, just, it, it, just in these photos. Uh, it's hard to tell whether these are actually stand-up stones or if they're manipulations of something else, uh, and then they made it look like a stone as usual. Uh, but you guys, as always, uh, get the last word, and... Uh, and like I said, everybody's comment to me counts. I mean, that's sometimes I don't see things clearly and I just go, oh, wow, these guys are absolutely right and found some crazy things in these. Anyway, guys, I'm not going to keep it much longer. I'm going to let you guys go for now, and uh, I'll see you in the next video.